Welcome to a brand new podcast. Once again, this is the Oracle 19, and my name is Greatness. A special shout out to all the new listeners that is uh, checking out this podcast, in which you can find us on Anchor.fm. Once again, Anchor.fm. Google Podcasts, Apple Podcasts, Spotify, iTunes, and all the rest of the major social media. You can find us there. And in the description boxes of all of those major platforms, you can find all our information there as well. Uh, if you want to continue supporting the machine, you can... Definitely uh, email me at evolutionoflondon at gmail.com. Once again, evolutionoflondon at gmail.com for any uh, free will offerings. Uh, Again, and also any business or sponsorship uh, questions or concerns or or inquiries. So right there is one stop shop of email so you can definitely send the information there and also if you want to continue uh, donating we do have in our description box GoFundMe page as well and you again you'll find it in the description box of all the major platforms and you can start off with anchor.fm and that will uh lead you to the other information music by cheap limousine channel you can find him on youtube cheap limousine there you have all the latest uh, beats definitely so for your enjoyment and also uh, through his uh, site or his page i should say uh, you can find all his major platforms so once again that's cheap limousine channel on YouTube and speaking about YouTube you can find us uh, we have two pages two channels I should say greatness 19 channel which we have over 100 videos and still building on uh, knowledge and education basically just to raise awareness and build your third eye and again it's always just it's just giving perspectives basically that's Greatness 19 channel. Also, you can check our health and wellness channel, which is Mr. Evolution of London. And there, that's our health and wellness channel, Mr. Evolution of London. And you can find that on YouTube as well. And then uh, in both description boxes of both of the channels, you can find links to other information to shop and and check out as well and speaking about shopping you can check out our website evolutionoflondon.com once again evolutionoflondon.com and there you are that's our little baby shopping mall which we have uh, pretty much close to 10,000 products a wide range of products from cologne perfume uh, house accessories, uh, towels, blankets, so forth, and makeup, jewelry. So it's a wide range of products. Again, one-stop shop, and that's our baby shopping mall at evolutionoflondon.com. And also our other website, which is evolutionoflondon.org. Once again, evolution of, uh, evolutionoflondon.org. O-R-G. There we have custom clothing and accessories and our digital products as well, our ebooks and software. So definitely check us out there and definitely uh, one way of supporting the machine is checking out the websites and, and supporting, buy something, or if not, share. But we would like your support there as well. Again, uh, uh, finally, and speak about websites, we do have a digital software and digital ebooks uh, website, which uh, that we just uh, launched that a couple weeks ago. So definitely look into that. 
That's royalty9.gumroad.com. Once again, that's royalty9.gumroad. That's G U M R O A D.com. There, once again, you'll find ebooks and software will be uh, coming soon. Uh, again, again, software such as for antiviruses for your computer, just a uh, name uh, will be a uh, name a few, I should say, uh, software such as that, and also learning business and strategies in terms of building your brand. Those uh, software will be coming soon uh, as the weeks go by. We add more products there. So, royalty9.gumroad.com. Definitely check us out there. And also, we definitely can't. Uh, to get our sponsor, Mr. Will. He's a fitness consultant, and he also deals with health and wellness as well. He do have a website. Definitely check him out and support his machine, which is www.wjaaccessories.com. Once again, w w jaaccessories.com and also if you have any questions or concerns and you need his assistance because again he's a fitness consultant Willie's Fitness 99 at gmail.com once again that's Willie's Fitness 99 at gmail.com that's W-I-L-L-Y-Z Fitness 99 at gmail.com Again, uh, any other information, you can uh, definitely check us out in our description box, and then we'll have the rest of the information. And coming soon, we do have another sponsor that will be uh, coming on board to the machine. And he has a, a website as well, which is multiraffles.com and that's coming soon so we will have his information coming soon and we will be breaking that down in detail as well so multiraffles.com coming soon to a theater near you but anyway welcome we definitely appreciate joining the, the machine here so coming soon, uh, most likely in the next couple of weeks, and then we'll have all his information in our description box, and we will be breaking down his his brand as well. All right. Well, today we're going to talk about something which this is within our daily life, especially now in this day and time. It's self defense. Self-defense, especially for us humans out here. Now, what do I mean about that? The art of self-defense. You know, in this day and time, so many things is going on in the world. A lot of violence, as you know. And it's about protecting thyself. And I'm giving my perspective. Now, I do think us citizens should be, should have a certain art of defense, knowing how to protect ourselves. I think that especially men in general should know how to defend themselves, protect their family, protect themselves. And... One, working out, definitely is, is, I feel, essential. Now, I know a lot of people, is hard for them because, again, you have so much responsibilities. You have to work and, and pay your bills and your mindset is on that and then taking care of your family. So I, I get that. But, again, protecting yourself, working out. 
Uh, now, you don't have to be a necessarily a, a gym rat, and meaning just working out six, seven days a week. But you should work out, especially you men. And ladies, too, because if you're working and you traveling, you know, daily, and if somebody run up on you, you should be able to defend yourself. I'm a firm believer in citizens being able to protect thyself, especially ones that are striving, trying to do the right thing. You don't want your well-being, yourself, or your property to be taken away from you. So, working out, get stronger, build the body. So, if you had to defend yourself, you stand a better chance to get away from the situation or subdue the other person. And there's different ways from expanding on working out and going to the gym. If you can't afford to go to the gym, at least work out from home. Do, you know, calisthenics, which is the push-ups, sit-ups, jumping jacks. It's just building your body or being strong enough, again, to protect yourself. And then it's also good for your overall well-being. That's very important. Now, some people uh, want to take it to the next level and perform martial arts, which I think is a very good thing. But again, affordability, that's another thing. And then time. But if you do have the time, I would I highly suggest martial arts. Because again, it has a lot of benefits. Again, not only being able to defend yourself, but developing your mind to have a, a good discipline about yourself. And confidence as well so definitely and now a lot of people will say what type of uh, martial arts all depends you all all depends of thyself now what I mean by that let's say if you're a big let's just say a big man 300 pounds 350 a lot of men that is of that size is not that quick but so they might need to be good with their hands they might need like a uh, martial arts such as judo which is up close and they just grab or let's say if a person is a heavier person I, I should say that might need be good in up close battle and that's what judo might come in and again that's debatable I, because all your martial art people out there, they will say, I'm a big guy, I can do Taekwondo, and so forth, so on. It's debatable. But all depends of thyself, what you feel comfortable. We talk about comfort here and protecting thyself. We not just talk about which martial arts is the best, okay? So that's where I'm looking at. And if you're a smaller person, you might need a, a certain martial arts that is using your uh, speed so you could get in and get out of a uh, opponent so again that's perspective you might need something uh, art like Shotokan karate or taekwondo which is a lot of kicking and, and fast movements is in and out more often see so again it's debatable because for all your martial art guys out here you will definitely say no this is not good this is good so forth so on Again, this is just about general protection and your body type. The average, okay? The average person. You just know thyself. You just might need a couple quick moves and get out of a situation. It's all perspective, guys. So you know, I, I have to give you that statement there. But it's, again, it's all about self-defense, improving your health, your mental and physical. So I highly suggest martial arts as well in terms of the art of self-defense now also the art of self-defense is also in the mind it's your mind state because it starts with your mind first before anything to start anything you gotta get guys you gotta get your mind right in in terms of self-defense 
especially the propaganda that is put out here, things that you see on TV, that things that is in front of you to brainwash you. Self-defense comes from the mind. It's protecting your mind from all of these, I should say, distractions that is out here in modern day society. So that's another form of psychic self-defense. You need to protect your mind for all, from all the chaos that's out here. Keep your mind strong. Discipline yourself. Discipline your mind. Reduce the vices that, that is overcoming you. Self-defense. Such as the vices that you overindulge to slow yourself down. Whether it's the drugs, the alcohol, the sex. Or example of vices that reduces your psychic self-defense. Reduces to give you distractions. To produce distractions to take you off your path. To be mentally stronger. This is something that you need to build. This is the art of psychic self-defense. Self-defense. So definitely start improving your mental health. Little things makes a big difference. To build yourself up. Not only physically but mentally. And mentally is just as big as physical. Because if your mental is not right. You can't can't do anything physically anyway. So this is a form of the art of self defense. Very important. Another perspective I would say about self defense. Is your eating habits. You know you heard the the saying. You are what you eat. And. This. Is a domino effect. Poor diet. Produces. Can produce poor mental health. In which. Can produce. Poor physical health. Therefore, you won't be able to defend yourself properly, mentally or physically. So, this is very important. It's a domino effect, eating habits. I use that for myself. You know, certain habits of eating that even though I I, I try to eat pretty good, you know, and and take supplements and teas and so forth, certain teas, just not any. But sometimes one thing I like is uh, I like cheese. I can eat cheese every day. And that's no good because it's dairy. And it contains a lot of sodium. So that's just an example of certain vices that I, I have. But try to do better. Reduce your intake. And then you find that improving your your health and wellness. Everybody has a weakness out here. This is just they have strength and they have weaknesses. We all do. So the question you have to ask yourself is what can you do to improve yourself to gain to become stronger in self-defense. Now, I just gave you many, many different examples of the art of self-defense. Mental, physical, and a certain side of spiritual. Now, I'm going to talk about a little bit on the spiritual side, which a lot of people overlook. Now, Spiritual is not necessarily being religious. 
okay? It's spiritual, you can be, it's meditation. And meditation can help heal thyself, believe it or not. Because the power is in the mind. So, this will also improve, it's a domino effect. Meditation could be in a room by yourself and just calming your mind. Have a room where it smells very good. It bring, smell, smell bring a, a certain vibration. Could be bad or good. So you want certain things in the room, such as incense. In certain incense, frankincense, jasmine, myrrh, which can help, again, raise your spiritual self. Therefore, even healing yourself mentally and also healing yourself physically. Now, if you are religious, that can also help you, especially if you highly re- religious, whether you're a Christian, or a Jew, or Muslim, whatever de- uh, denomination. If you're strong in your convictions, that can also raise your spiritual level. Now, I'm not going to be critical which, what religion is right and wrong. Not in this case, okay? This is about the art of self-defense. Again, I gave you examples because it's a domino effect. See, things have a domino effect. So you have to know thyself in your own circumference to build the levels of your spirit which will make you stronger mentally as well as physically and include proper diet, of course. So again, I gave you examples because this all of this coal is, uh, coal, uh, comes together. That's what I want to say. I know I had another word to say. But I have so much in my head, so sometimes I could be babbling, so forgive me. But come together. All of the information I mentioned to you is all about coming together to improve your overall overall health and strength in the art of self-defense. And it's all about a domino effect. So pay attention to the signs. If you haven't done it yesterday, the beautiful thing is today is your day. Today is your special day in which you can build thyself to defend yourself and your family. Because especially you men, there's only one of you. You only have one temple. And also you ladies, same thing. You only have one temple, one life. Because after this life, That's it. Now I know y'all guys might get philosophical and say, nope, there's, you can, you coming back as an egg or you coming back as an eggplant or you coming back as a tree. Uh, we not, this is not for, that, for this conversation. This is just about the art of self-defense and improving yourself through self-defense, mentally and physically and spiritually, and food, diet, so you can protect thyself against the world, against your enemy, whoever that might be. And the enemy don't not necessarily a person. It's when you're out in the streets, you should be prepared to protect yourself and your loved ones by any means necessary stay strong